Hi, fishy folks, and happy Super Saturday to you. Hope everyone had a great Thanksgiving if you're in the United States. If you're not in the United States, I hope your Thursday and Friday were uneventful. Um, Thanksgiving is a holiday we celebrate here on Thursday. Uh, we have turkey and a big feast and lots of people, and, and we're supposed to talk about what we're thankful for. And then on Friday, it's Black Friday, where we would stab someone in the neck for a $10 toaster if they get in our way. So it's kind of cool. Anyway, um, today's video is going to be on a review of a China light. That's right, folks, a China light. Put on your big girl panties and just deal with it or, or stop watching if it offends you. Just don't go where it's too warm because you're a snowflake. Anyway, so I get review requests all the time. And I just got one this morning, actually, from Natalie Hawkins. Hello, I'm Sebastian. I know. But it says Natalie Hawkins on it. See it? But I'm Sebastian from Modville. I've watched a few of your videos and they're created to convert. We manufacture, get this, compression knee sleeves and would love to send you our latest product for a true and unbiased video review of the overall feel and look of, and performance of the product. You, you don't watch my videos. You would know. I don't even complain about knee pain. I don't really have knee pain, so. Yeah, so that's the kind of crap I get. Now, a couple months ago before I went to Japan, I did get one that I found very interesting, and this one is from Zenzio Aquarium Collaboration Invitation is the subject. And uh, Abel emails me. This is a bell from the Zenzio, a seller specializing in the aquarium product, and I've come across your channel, very interested on your video on YouTube. Now normally, I've tried to vet them by saying, oh, what's your favorite video? And like the Marillion guys, they were like, oh, we've watched this video and this video and this video. We know you're honest. We know if you don't like it, you're gonna trash it, blah, blah, blah. I knew they watched my videos. I decide, I knew this guy didn't watch my videos. I decided not even to bother because I kind of need a light, right? You know, the light's broken back there. Um, anyway, after careful consideration, we would like to invite you to be part of an exclusive group of participants for a new beta program designed to assist us in our marketing research efforts. I'm honored. I am wondering if we have the honor to cooperate with you. It will be appreciated if you can make reviews of our extendable LED light on your YouTube channel. Okay. So, like I said, here's normally where I would say, well, what's your favorite video? How did you find me? But I just went right for the jugular. Sure, send me the light and here's my address. Thank you for your letter, was the response I get. Could you tell me where you live and which countries your YouTube viewers come from? Boom, they don't watch my channel at all. Pretty sure everyone who watches me knows I'm from the United States. Perhaps you think I'm from Canada, but either way, Canada, United States, not anywhere else. So I told them the USA, viewers in USA, England, Australia, and many other countries. Those are actually the, the rankings of... So Canada, step up your game. Thank you for your letter. Could you tell me how about your idea for showing the light on your YouTube video? My response, nope. Send it and you'll see. You watch my videos, you know how I am. So blah, 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 goes on and on and on. Long story short, uh, while I was in Japan, the package arrived and I haven't opened it yet. And I've got I got from Japan two weeks ago. Here's the package. You can see it's from China. I don't know if it's gonna focus, but you can see that. And so here it's packed here. I would be surprised if it's in one piece. But let's uh let's open it and see what it's like. Got the man knife. Oh, by the way, boys and girls, I don't know if you're interested while I'm opening this, let's talk about my new YouTube channel on cooking. It's called Michael's Eats. There will be a link here and down below. A couple people have mentioned, especially in live streams, uh, <clears throat> I'd make a good food channel. I could make a good food channel because I'm a fat guy and I talk about food a lot, which is very true. So I did. And so the first video uh, will be released 
Saturday, December, uh, November 30th, which is probably before you watch this, because this will probably come out Saturday evening. Anyway, there's the light. Lots of Chinese. Look at this. It's an official China light. Come on, focus. Focus, it's not focusing. Made in China. For fresh and salt water, suit for tank 60 to 70 centimeters. Quick, how long is that? Stimulates plant growth and intensifies fish colors. Warning, before using this product, warning, before using the product, the user must check whether the marked voltage on the nameplate is consistent with the actual voltage. When installing or removing the lamp, it's necessary to cut off the power supply to ensure safety. Please protect the lamp. If there's a serious collision, please check whether the lamp broke body is broken. If there is a rupture, please stop using it immediately. A collision. In order to ensure the safety of use, the product is strictly prohibited from soaking. In order to ensure the safety of use, the product is strictly prohibited from soaking. So, you guys know I work for Subaru. I do a lot of translation from Japanese to English. That's what I would call a Jinglish sentence. I guess we'd have to call it a Chinglish sentence for China. I know snowflakes are melting all over the world hearing me say this. Grow up. It's just how I talk. Anyway, quite frankly, it looks like a piece of crap, but you know, what I find interesting is there's a sticker here that says Zenzio. But underneath it is another company's name. I can't tear it off. It's like R-O-Z-I-A maybe. All right, well, wish me luck, folks. I'm going in. Comes with a thermometer. I'm gonna actually read the directions because they'll probably be pretty funny. They fell. Zenzio four rows LED aquarium light. It does have four rows of LEDs. So English, Russian, Dutch, French, and Chinese. English. <clears throat> it's really small and I'm old, so bear with me. This product is only suitable for indoor use. Please confirm that the service voltage is the same as the input voltage. It says it on the package, on the, on the thing. 110 volt. Okay, we're good. Oh, the, the manufacturer is ROHS. That's what the sticker under Zenzil is. So they must just be the distributor. <gasps> I missed this. Oh my gosh, look. A coupon code for 20% off. Email register on www.zenzil.com. Get 20% off when order is over $10. By the way, I'll put a link in the description below. It'll be an Amazon affiliate link. I will make quadrillions if you just hover over it. Anyway, I'll try to find this light on YouTube. And, not YouTube, on Amazon and put the link down below. Let's get back to the instructions. I'm gonna start over in case you missed it. By the way, do you have a snack and a beverage? If not, you should get one. Let me know in the comments below what light you like to use, what you think of the cheap China light, and snack and beverage choice. And if you're in the United States or you celebrate Thanksgiving, what was the favorite dish from Thanksgiving? Mine was the in the bird sausage stuffing that my brother-in-law made. He does a really good job. There's a lot of people there, but he did a really good job. He always does a good job. Anywho, I digress. The product is only suitable for in your indoor use. Please confirm the service voltage. We did. Please do not put any items, especially flammable and explosive materials, on this powered product. It's good advice. No explosives on the light. The lamp is non-submersible. Using it in water is forbidden. The power switch is not waterproof. Please use it carefully. Now, 
it's not waterproof. But you would think, knowing this is an aquarium light, they would, I guess that would make it more expensive anyway. <laughs> avoid children touching. I will definitely avoid children touching. Oh my god, that's so funny. Uh, any accidents caused by improper use of this product or improper maintenance are irrelevant to our company. Basically, if you drop it in the water, we don't give a crap. That's that's exactly what that means. And don't forget, no children touching. Oh, that's spectacular. And then it tells you cleaning and maintenance product parameter. So let's see, which one did they send me? They sent me the AZX... 0391 16 watt. Okay. 3500 lumens. Okay. So, oh. Okay, it just says how to install, how to how to put the brackets on. So, that might be a problem for me cuz I'm going to put this where that 36 inch light I think was that broke by the um, super red pleco tank. That over there. Got another plastic bag. White plastic? Yeah, white plastic. Screwed together. We got these fancy dandy thingy things. So I guess this is supposed to, I don't, oh, I get it. If. So in Europe and Japan and China, there's a lot of the rimless tanks. That's for rimless tanks. I got it. I'm picking up what they're putting down. So we're going to take them off because I don't have rimless tanks. All right, folks, here's what the plan is going to be. I'm going to close the man knife so I don't cut myself. Got to practice knife safety. Then I'm going to go set the, uh, the light up, test it. No, that's not true. I am going to put the light on, bring the camera over, turn the camera on and test it live for you guys on TV. On TV, on YouTube. All right, how does that sound? Um, do me a favor and stand by. All right, fishy folks, there's the light. That little white strip. I mean, it's small like every other light. Um, I mean, I don't have that many LED lights to compare it to, but construction seems about as normal as the other ones I guess I don't want to say cheap because I don't know yet so um, I had this one set up to an outlet that's uh, behind me actually in the fish room on the ceiling not to the timer uh, because I, I won't be able to do that turn it on and off uh, for you guys so I'm just gonna turn it on and see what it looks like here we go drum roll please Ta-da! Hey, it's on. Works. Lights up the tanks. All right, we'll, we'll put it through its paces. We'll see how it goes. And uh, yeah. Guys, if you haven't done so already, please consider subscribing to this channel as well as my new channel. If you like me and my comedy and you want to hear a fat guy talk about food very passionately. Uh, the new channel is Michael's Eats and I uh, hope everyone has a great week. See ya. fishy folks and happy super saturday to you if you are in the united states i hope you had a great thanksgiving if you are not in the united states i hope your thursday was good anyway today's video is going to be a review of a china light that's right folks pull your big boy panties on and listen to the china light video china light video no Hi, fishy folks, and happy Super Saturday to you. Hope everyone had a great Thanksgiving over in the, in the uh, mush mouth.